global dignity. In 2005, uh, we met with this uh, impressive group of people, kind of like you're doing now, uh, in Sarmat, Switzerland. It was the first summit of the young global leaders. Uh, and um, we started talking about all the major issues of the world. Climate, like you've been doing now. Health, uh, development, poverty alleviation, security, etc. And everyone were doing great work, coming together, you know, making action plans, timetables. We had it all down. We knew what we needed to do. And we were being effective, efficient, and we were doing great work. But we weren't really talking about why. And where does all this come from? Why do we want to do something good for people that are not our relatives, that are not our friends, that maybe live far away from us, in a different part of the world? Where does this come from, this energy that we want to change the world to the better? That we want to do something concrete in our own community, but we also want to do something good for other people far away from us. And um, my friends, uh, John Bryant and Pekka and myself, we started talking about, so, so what is this? What, what is the source that all of these people uh, are uh, tapping into? Uh, if we look at the major names of history, if we look at Nelson Mandela, uh, Desmond Tutu, Mother Teresa, um, Martin Luther King Jr., what did they all have in common? They wanted to do something good for other people. They wanted to lift other people and increase other people's dignity. And dignity, we were talking about, was the core value. That was what was at the center of what, of what we were trying to do.